Hi, this is Vicki, Condi Systems Tech Support. Today I'm going to show you how to clean the encoder strip on the E4000 series printers. This will include the 4880, the 4800, and the, 40, the 4000, which is the Epson series 4000 printers. And what the encoder strip is going to do for you when you clean it is to prevent any errors. If you have crashes with your print head, uh, sometimes debris, ink, deposits get on the encoder strip and it causes your printhead to crash more frequently. However, this is something that you would only do if advised by someone here in our support staff to do it. So you'll refer to the video and it's going to walk you through it. So I'm going to get started showing you where the encoder strip is and the materials you're going to use to clean is the alcohol and a lint-free cloth. So let's get started. Okay, so we're going to come in here and get this little thin strip right here. That's exactly what you're looking for. It's clear, so it's a little hard to find, so make sure that you uh, get the right thing. And what this strip has is vertical lines, which is, uh, has a little timing on it that counts those lines so that it knows the position of the printhead. And so we want to take our cloth and go left to right, right to left, cleaning that thin strip as far as you can go in there. And uh, a couple of swipes should do it. And there you go, you've cleaned it. And now I've shown you how to clean the encoder strip on your E4000 series printer. Again, that's your 4880, your 4000, and your 4800 Epson series printers for uh, sublimation or any purposes where your, your head may be crashing too frequently. Give us a call at Tech Support. Before doing this, make sure that uh, we've instructed you correctly. The video will do that for you. And any questions at all, you can contact us here at Condi Systems Support. Anyone in our department should be able to walk you through this or at least get you to a video where you, you can do it correctly. Again, my name is Vicki. I'm with Condi Systems. Thank you for your time.